trend said I got style for you. Ain't seen you at the top, it's been a while for you. Big you up and they look down on you. Take one loss, no one's around for you. I won't stop. Hello my YouTube fam, it's Kiana and welcome back to Kiana's Creative Closet. So today my loves, I told y'all I was bringing back my styling portions where I'll um, do lookbooks either once a week or every other week depending on how many items I get in for hauls. Um, so yeah, I'm glad to be back. I'm glad to show you some beautiful spring pieces. I'm going to show you a lot of bold colors. Y'all know color is the trend this year. I know the people who have been watching me for a while probably saying, Kiana, what is going on? You are a neutral girl, but I have really been feeling color this season. So if you think that some of you are interested in seeing, continue to watch. But before we get started, if you are new here and you love fashion like I do, please feel free to subscribe down below. Hit that bell. That's the notification bell. And it lets you know every time I upload a new video. To my OG and my OG supporters and my new supporters, new subscribers, welcome back, my loves. Thanks for the continued support. So let's jump into it. Okay, my love. So this is the first look. And this is the yellow dress that I showed y'all um, a few videos back in my Fashion Nova haul. It's from Fashion Nova. I absolutely love this dress. And you guys went crazy for this dress. I was sending this dress back, but you convinced me to keep it. So I did want to style it up for you and show you how I will wear it um, when I do go out. Now, the reason why I wasn't going to keep it because of the back. Y'all see it is a full back opening. And it's a little big here um, at the sides. So what I'm going to do is take it to the same dress and have her tighten the back up or bring the back in just a little bit more. But for right now... It's fine. I just paired it with a bandeau top. When you have a dress similar to this, um, with all the all your back out and you don't really want to show your rows, just throw it on a bandeau top underneath, or a tank top is your preference. I decided on a bandeau top since it has the V-neck. I love the V-neck of this dress. I love the exaggerated slit of this dress. It's just giving batty, honey. <laughs> I love it. I love, love, love her. Now, I'm going to tell y'all through this video, I have on um, smoothing shapewear. I don't have on firming shapewear because I got a procedure done um, yesterday and my stomach is very tender from it and I'm a little bit bloated. So, don't mind. Y'all going to see a little fluff in this video. But, yeah, I decided to pair her with a pair of flat sandals. When I do... Um, slits that's very high or um, really short pieces. I tend to go with flat shoes just so I can um, kind of dress it down or keep it from being overly sexy. So I decided to pair it with these Kanye Color Dad sandals. These are backless. I got these last year from, it was either Just Fab or Shoe Dads who I always get them mixed up. But it was from one of the two. And then I decided to go ahead with this Kanye Clutch. This is from Amazon. They still have it. I will link this below for you. It comes in a few different colors. And this really came in handy. I pulled her out a lot. This one and I have a cream one. Um, I decided to pair these down with Kanye Colors. This dress because the dress is very vibrant. I could have went um, for a... I have a, a purse that's the same color of this. But I think it would have just been over the top. So I feel like when you have on um, really bright colors, sometimes you need to pair it down with your taupes, your browns, your creams, your whites, and sometimes black. Um, so that's why I went with the cognac color. Um, you could have went with something white or something cream, but I think this is very nice. Um, I have to get a lot, of, well, as much weight as I can out of this before the weather changes. Right now, it's really cool in my area. Now, of course, spring and summer, you think of shades. So, I will wear these shades with this dress. And these are a pair of shades from Free People. I got them last year. Sorry about that. That's my ring. But I got these last year from Free People. And these are my favorite shades. I pulled these shades out more than some of the designer shades that I have here <laughs> in my closet. So, this will be the look.
Okay, my love, so this is the next look, um, and it's just this satin skirt. I picked this satin skirt up last year from H&M. Um, I never got a chance to wear it because I got it kind of like at the end of the season, um, and it was on clearance. I think I picked this up for no more than 15 bucks. Um, I paired it with this bodysuit. I think the bodysuit is from Fashion Nova. It's either from Fashion Nova or Shein, and then I just threw on the dad sandals. You would have seen these in my last two videos. I love these sandals. They're very comfortable. And these sandals are a good way to dress down a very dressy piece. So the skirt to me is more on the dressier side because this one is more uh, has more of a sheen to it or gloss to it. Um, it's cut on the bias. And it, it to me, this one, this slip skirt looks a little bit more dressier than the other ones that I have in my closet. So I think that's probably why I didn't really get a chance to wear this last year. The slit is supposed to be in the front of the skirt. I do not like it in the front, so I just turned it a little bit for it to be on the side. But this um, is the look. And the skirt is a very good quality. So I would, um, if I was going out and it was a little bit breezy, especially in the spring months, I would throw on a blazer over top so this lavender blazer um, matches very very well with the skirt it's almost a dead on um, match so I will probably do something like this um, I will probably pair it with this clutch which is a bone color clutch this is the same clutch as the cognac one that I just shown you is just in a bone color so this is the look you can wear the jacket as I have it um, over my shoulders, which I do a lot. Or you can actually put it on. It does look good on with it fully on the body as well as over the shoulders. So this is the look that I was going for. Actually, it's not the look that I was going for because when I first thought of this outfit, I thought about my um, white Gucci meals and a white bodysuit with this blazer. But I put my meals, I took my meals to the cobbler and I actually forgot. So I had to switch up last minute and I think I pulled it off pretty nicely. I normally don't like cool tones. That's another reason why I probably never wore this skirt. I normally don't like cool tones. So the blazer and the skirt, the shoes and the bag are cool tones. But I think it looks pretty good. You let me know. Okay, so this is the next look, and this is the vest that I actually picked up from Eloquy about a month or a little over a month ago. Y'all died for this vest. So I definitely wanted to show you another way rather than just wearing it with the pants. The last time I styled it, I styled it with a pair of trousers, I think a turtleneck underneath, and a pair of mules. Um, now that the weather is getting a little bit warmer, I will wear it like this as a dress. Now, this is leather, so you have to be mindful that um, you don't want to wear it on those really, really hot days. Right now, where I am, it's really, really chilly. And if you're on the East, East, East Coast, um, I'm pretty sure it's like that for most of us. So, I can get away with wearing this right now, early spring. Um, and I think it looks really nice as a dress. So, um, I paired it this way. I wore this as a dress. Now, this is a double-breasted vest, so it only has four buttons, I mean two buttons, the two buttons here that um, buttons up. So, if you are nervous about not wearing anything under it, just throw on a pair of short shorts and you'll be fine. Um, you can even wear it open with a pair of short shorts and a pair of strappy sandals or mules like I have it on today. Um, and a bodysuit, but I just decided to do it as a dress. Um, I'm going to let you know, even if this, the wind blows, it's covered. You're not going, it's not one of those ones where um, it's a little bit um, like a V in the front. This is like a regular jacket or trench coat. So even when the wind blows, you're going to be covered. So I don't have anything on under it, and I probably wouldn't wear anything under it. Um, I paired it with these meals. These are a pair of meals that I picked up from Rainbow. Um, and these meals are so comfortable. I love them. They are in a cognac 
Well, actually, they're in a nude. They're in my color nude, <laughs> um, and they're patent leather. And I just decided to, again, throw it on with this clutch. Now, you can be bold and pair with any of the colors in this vest because it's multiple colors. But, again, um, I wanted to tone it down a little bit because there's a lot of colors going on in this vest. Now, this vest is definitely giving me Emilio Pucci vibes. This vest is everything. So, this is the back of her. Um, and this is the front. This may be a little extra. Some people may think it's a little too extra to be wearing it as a dress, but I don't. Um, but it's multiple ways you can wear it. If you um, need another option, just go to my video. It's the video where I, um, doing a collective haul. I have a Hanifa item in there. I have Eloquy. I have a few pieces, even Walmart. So check that out. But this is the look. Let me know what you think and i definitely would throw on some shades so with this set i definitely would still wear the same shades that, um um what is this i forgot the name child but these same sh um the glasses from free people i'll throw these on because i think it just gives rich girl vibes and this is the look okay my love so this is the next look and these pink pants i just hauled these in my last video I love these jeans. I do wish I would have went up a size because they are a little tight in my mid area. Um, I did tell y'all I'm a little bloated from my procedure yesterday. Um, I paired them with these shoes. I'm not sure where I got these shoes from, you guys. I'm going to be honest. I had them for many years, but I think they are a perfect match with these pants. And I love this these um, shoes paired with these. This is a block heel. They are very, very comfortable. I haven't worn these in a couple of years, and these used to be my go-to shoes because of the comfortability. Um, I decided to also pair it with this white satin shirt that I picked up from H&M. I just have it crisscrossed over in the front and tucked in the jeans. Now, I should have probably did a better job of tucking it um, because it seemed like I got a little pouch here, but it's okay. This is just for video purposes, but if I was going out, um, I would probably maybe put it through my belt loops and then tuck it in so you won't see much gathering here but this is the look and i love it i would definitely pair it with this white bag this is a chanel dupe that i picked up from ego official last spring summer and absolutely love her and i will also same thing these glasses these are my go-to for spring and summer. And I think this it's just a chic look. Let me see. Yes, it's giving, it's giving Lux. It's giving I'm rich. I love, love, love her. I know pink may be a little bit too bold or too much for some people. I'm normally not a fan of this like baby pink, but I think it works pretty well. Okay, y'all, so this is the next look. And y'all know, if y'all been watching me for a while, this is definitely not my style. But I wanted to give it a try. Y'all know I've been playing in color a lot lately. So I thought this would be cute. Um, these jeans I picked up from Fashion Nova a while back. Um, the cardigan is from H&M. Y'all have seen this cardigan many times. I love it that much. Um, and then I just paired it with a pair of gold platform shoes. I picked these gold shoes up from... ASOS. Now with these shoes, um, they sell out a lot and they may be sold out now, but if you really like them, um, just get on, I think they an uh, email list because they come in stock all the time. They come back in stock all the time. So if you really want them, if they sold out, just that's something that you could do. Just F um, FYI. Um, and then I paired it with this um, metallic Go clutch that I picked up from Essie. I love this clutch, you guys. I'm thinking about getting in another color. I love the size of it. It's an oversized um, clutch, so this is perfect for spring and summer. Um, and this is the look. I decided to pull the cardigan off the shoulder just a little bit, and I have it tucked in today. Um, I tucked it in, but you don't have to wear it tucked in. You could put on a bodysuit or a tank top, a crop top underneath this, and leave it open um but i just decided to go ahead and button it and um half tuck it in so this is the look let me turn to the back for you 
yeah um this is not a favorite of mine but again i'm trying to play with play in colors just a little bit to see what i like and don't like i do love that the sweater is multicolored, so that's a good option when you're trying to color block and you're not sure what colors pair well together um just find a top or a pair of pants that have multiple colors and you can go off of that so i do love that the orange in the um pants match perfect with the orange in the sweater so it was a no-brainer um i don't like normally light jeans that have the slit on the side i just feel like sometimes it can give it a weird look as well as sometimes it's hard to pair with different shoes you have to be mindful of what shoes you will wear with jeans like this um i do feel like these go well with the platforms at first i thought it was going to give it too much of a retro look um 70s style look but i don't think so i, I don't think so at all or if it do it's a, a um more modern type of 70s style look but i do like it i think it's um giving it's spring appropriate you tell me what you think <laughs> okay so this is another look and i decided to show you this look um because easter is approaching and i feel like this is something cute that you can wear on easter to your easter service not too dressy especially for my ladies who go to churches where it's a little bit more casual and people are not really dressed up my church is that way some people are dressed to the teeth and some people are dressed down um i tried sometimes i dress up and other times you know i keep it simple but i think this is cute it's it's giving spring all the way y'all know i just hold this dress from shein very cute dress um it's a little bit see-through so i will wear um appropriate undergarments under it something skin tone or something black but this is the dress very simple the shoes are also from Shein as well as the bag. I kept it monochromatic. Um, I'm going to style this up different um, for you. Maybe in the next styling portion because I have something coming in that I want to pair this dress with. But for right now, I just did a simple, cute Easter look. Very plain Jane, but um, still put together. So I love it. Um, tell me what you think. Y'all know. You can wear these style of um, dresses with flats or heels. I have on heels today, but I wear these all the time with a pair of flat sandals. So, yeah, this is the look. All right, my loves, that brings me to the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed all of the items that I styled up for you today. Um, all of these items are pieces that I pull from my closet. Some of them are newer than others. Um, I, I tell people all the time, before you start going and making these major purchases, shop your closet. You'll be surprised how, how pieces that you find in your closet that you never worn or you haven't worn in a very long time. Just how you can change it up and make different looks out of those pieces. So that's why I bring these styling portions to you to give you motivation to go in your closet, find items that are similar or somewhat of the same and try to put some pieces together before you start buying your new spring and summer items. All right. So if you stay this long, do me a favor, like the video, hit that thumbs up, leave me comments down below on which piece or which item you you like the most <laughs> let me know which one i styled up for you today that you love the most all right see you in the next one Bye bye